Do you all see that? It's like it's lost in my skin. Lady Gaga. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing? In today's video, I'm gonna be covering the new house lab foundation by Lady Gaga. Everybody's been talking about this foundation and I went out to get my shade, but they did not have it in stock. So what did I do? I got me a sample. Now this is a Triclone Skin Technology Foundation. Light wear, it is a clean foundation. It has a fermented Arcanica found in the foundation. And that Arcanica basically is something that evens your skin tone and correct your skin tone at the same time and minimize redness. Now this comes in 51 shades and it retails right around $45. The shade that I got is 580 and I think that's the shade that I wear um, because I did test it and 580 which is the deep medium neutral so if your skin tone is like mine I'm between the red and the yellow you want to stay neutral when you're buying any foundation try to stay neutral I already did my underpainting and this is a new technique that I do whenever I want my foundation to stay longer and you guys know I like to pick it up on the sponge and then dap it off in my hands just to make sure the sponge absorb it and then I go in especially when I'm doing this under painting and you can sit right there so that's where I'm putting it right there I love it do you all see that that's what it looks like really good coverage Again, when you do this underpainting technique anyway, you're going to get good coverage from your products. And I'm just trying to blend out under the eyes. But I love it. Now, if you want under your eyes to look a little more brighter, which I do, I'm going to go in with the NARS Radiant. And this is in... I can't see this thing. I don't have all my glasses. Whatever shade this is. I try and leave it, but I normally like right there to be a little brighter, just right under my eyes, right there. Just, and this concealer is on the very last leg. I need to get some more, but I just put it right there. I'm going to let it dry for a little bit, or I can speed up the process by using my fan, because we ain't got time. I'm going to use my Givenchy setting powder, a tap off, and I'm going to press. And I press lightly first. Press lightly. Because the last thing you want is a batch of the powder sitting on the skin. So I go in and I press. All right. All set. Favorite bronze. Yeah, from Black Radiant. I'm just going to go in and bronze up the skin. And first it looked like there's nothing coming up. But then it just creates that beautiful shadow and of course I'm gonna dark up that little area with my Morphe bronzer which I love to you guys may be like how many products you love a lot <laughs> beautiful isn't it I love it I love this foundation listen Lady Gaga you have come for the girls yes like uh, Madame maybe mm hmm now this um, blush can be really mm, but I don't want all that mm today. All right, because I'm doing a mm lip. I'm gonna use his liquid lipstick today. So that's what it looks like, guys. I will check back in around six hours, because as you guys already know, I am going to church. So I will check back in six hours and let you guys know how the foundation is standing up what it looks like all right so the grease is right around these area and of course my nose somewhat my t-zone right and especially right here if i get closer you'll see what i'm talking about right other from that the shade range is perfect the match to my skin tone look at it so you guys know we normally match to our necks, right? Well, I do. Some people match to their chest. I match to my neck. 
Look at my neck and look at the foundation. What? Lady Gaga did this. I don't care what y'all say. If you have redness to your skin tone, some yellowness, get a foundation that is neutral so you won't have to go in with this product and fix it. But if you don't, pick up this from LA Girl and this is again it's a mixing foundation pigment and what it does is just neutralize, especially this color, neutralize your foundation to your skin tone, make it neutral. And I live, I love, I live, I love it. So that is my final review. Makeup did not move apart from just right there on my nose area and right around here you can see where it's breaking up. And again, I did not use such a mattifying setting powder. I just use a regular setting powder which is one of my favorite from Givenchy and it works really well. So that's all I have to say about this foundation. Pick it up. It's worth the $45. Really worth it. Anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. If you have any questions, make sure you leave them below. Share these videos, like these videos, and I'll see you all on my very next video.